I thought that we had agreed to vote for David. Yeah, me and me thought Penny would be the better option, so that's why we voted for her. I just couldn't stand Chase, so, you know. Yeah, but I think, like, we should come to a consensus, right? Because I was completely, like, unaware of that. Chase was going home. Ah, uh, sorry, Luca. Next time I'll tell you. Okay, good. So, the four of us still tight? Yeah. Okay. Last night, I voted for David to go home. Because that's what I thought the tribe was doing, but it turned out that there was a chase blindside going on. And that caught me by surprise, because I thought Carl was someone who would tell me about these things. So, I feel kind of betrayed by him, but... Hey. So guys, uh, you two want to form an alliance? Uh, sure, Phil, why not? I'm down with that. Cool. If we lose, who do we vote off? Well, I think we should, like, break up the Abigail and the Cole conflict. Definitely. I was thinking Abigail. Nicole seems like a better option, because she seems more of a social threat. Well, alright. Right now I feel like I'm in a very good spot. Just joined an alliance with Phil and Bobby. And I think they're trusting of me, so that's good. And we've agreed to vote off Nicole if we lose. Welcome survivors to your next immunity challenge. As you can see, Chase no longer with us. In this challenge, we select one member of the tribe to be the caller. It will lead the other blindfolded tribe mates to pick up bricks. When you get a brick, you bring it back. First tribe to have everyone bring back a brick wins immunity. But here's the twist. There's going to be one caller, and there's going to be three groups of two for either tribe. You will be tied to that group member, and you'll both be blindfolded. So, you guys a minute to strategize, and we'll begin. Okay. Calling for Moho, it's Carl, and for Gunya, it's Phil. Rachel's sitting out. Drivers ready? Go. Okay, Bobby, Steven, go straight. How much? Just keep going. You two wait here, okay? Uh, Luca, to your left. Caitlin, David, keep going straight. Keep going. All tribes seem to be getting somewhere. Okay, Lydia, move your hand. You're almost got it. Bobby, Steven, stop. Uh, Al, um, you and Abigail just, uh, to the left? You got it, Luca. Bring it back. Follow my voice. You two, keep going, keep going. Keep going, Luca, you've almost got it back. Uh, Lydia, follow my voice. Keep going straight, both of you. Abigail, to your uh, left, to your left. Bobby, get up, get up, man. You're almost there, guys, keep going. Moho has a slight lead with one block. You two are almost back, just a few more steps. Penny, May, uh, turn 180, doing 180 right now. Okay, bend down. You got it? You got it? Yeah, Phil. Bobby, Steven, you're almost there. Should we, like, how close are we? Just keep going. Both tribes right now have one block. Okay, Abigail, Al, keep coming forward. Keep going. Bobby, Steven, get up. You're not close to it. Take, like, three more steps. You're almost there. Penny, it's like right behind this tree, so feel around. David, it's like right there. I got it, Carl, I got it. Okay. Bobby, Steven, a few more steps, come on. Kenya has two. Moho still with one. Alright, you guys are almost back. Just uh, walk in a diagonal line, okay? It's for you two. But you guys are like right there. Just keep walking forward. Bobby, you got it? I got it, man, I got it. It's tribes, neck and neck. Are we almost there? Yeah, 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 you're right here, come on. David, you dropped it. I did? Come on, David. Alright, uh, Bobby, just keep walking straight. David drops the block. We've got a close one here. Come on, where is it? 
Caitlin, move your hand. You've almost got it. So close. Guys, keep walking. Caitlin grabs the block. She just seems to just be pulling David at this point. Just keep going straight. You're like almost there. Guys, watch out. You're going to crash into him. No, we won't. Just keep going forward, guys. Bobby, watch out for the plant. And Caitlin gets back with the block. Moho wins immunity, safe from the vote. Winning immunity is great, obviously. But in that challenge, David completely slowed us down. Like, he was terrible, so. Hate to say to the people in the tribe that I told you so, but I did. Even though I voted Penny, I still told them so. Where can it be? Hmm. Losing the challenge as the caller really sucked, but there was some silver lining to it. As they were all celebrating their win, I looked under the calling bench and there was a clue to the hidden immunity idols, so... I mean, that's pretty good. Oh my god, no way. Oh, guys, I have something like extremely important to tell you. Is that an idol? Yeah. Damn, nice job, Phil. That's not even the best bit. Well, spit it out, man. I learned about this season's twist. There's a twist? Yeah. It says, congratulations, you have found a hidden immunity idol. In this season, if you find two hidden immunity idols, you can combine them to form a super idol, which can be played up until the final seven. No way. Yeah. So if we can find another idol, we've got extreme power right now. Nice. And, uh... Who are we voting? Probably Nicole, maybe Abigail. Who cares? We got an idol. Knowing that Phil has an idol and he can make a super idol is extremely good information that I can use to help me. Okay. Welcome, Ganya, to your first tribal council. So how it's gonna work. I'm gonna ask you some questions about how the game's been going, and we'll get and vote for a person to leave the tribe. You guys got that? Alright, first question. You can go to Phil. You were the caller in the challenge, and you ultimately lost. Do you feel responsible for it? Uh, somewhat, Jeff. I mean, they put me in the position, and I let them down. So, I guess I do feel like it's my fault. Alright. Lydia, how has six days been going for your tribe? Well, it's been going okay, except there are some people who just don't get along with others. And this vote could really just, like, help us to have peace on the tribe. Rachel, do you know what she's talking about when Lydia says this? Of course, Abigail and Nicole have been at each other's throats since, like, day one. And one of them's probably going to be voted off. Nicole, how do you weigh into this? I think the tribe will make a good decision tonight because Abigail, she's just, I think it's her time to go. Yeah, right. You've been, like, annoying to everyone since day one. So have you. Well, I think it should be time to vote. Phil, you're up. Nicole, you make everyone mad. So, I'm not gonna miss you in the least. I don't like you, Abigail. You don't like me. One of us has gotta go. Hope it's you. Okay, I've tallied the votes. If anyone has a hidden immunity idol, would like to play it. Now is the time to do so. Alright, once the votes read the decision is final, person voted off will be asked to leave the tribal council area immediately. I read the votes. First vote, Abigail. Second vote, Nicole. Third vote, Nicole. It's two votes, Nicole. One vote, Abigail. Nicole. Three votes, Nicole. Fifth vote, Nicole. That's four votes, Nicole. One vote, Abigail. Second person voted off of Lakos Survivor, Sri Lanka. Nicole. Nicole, that's five votes. That's enough for tonight. I need you to bring me your torch. Nicole, the tribe has spoken. It's time for you to go. I'm mad. I really am. I don't see why they would have voted for me when Abigail was the one who should have gone. So, I hope the final seven consists of everyone from Moho and no one from Gunya.